Hello, my name is Zayas, an operations engineer from AWS Managed Services at the AWS office in Dublin, Ireland. Today, I'll show you how to create and set up AWS backup configurations on different work streams for AWS Managed Services with an Accelerate account. Let's get started. For this demonstration, I will show you how to create an on-demand backup in AMS Accelerate. Then I will show you how to restore the AWS resource using on-demand backup. AWS backup helps you manage and automate backups centrally and across AWS services. For more information, visit the links in the associated AMS documentation pages. Note, make sure that you have an EC2 resource running. Open the AWS Management Console, navigate to Services, then Storage, click AWS Backup, navigate to Settings, Configure Resources, and then confirm that EC2 is turned on. Return to the AWS Backup Console and choose Dashboard, and then create an on-demand backup. Let's fill out the template. Choose EC2 as the resource type. From the drop-down list button, select the instance ID that you want. For retention period, select days. Note that the days would range from one day to 100 years. Create new vault. Choose an AWS identity and access management role if you have one. Otherwise, leave it as the default. Choose create on demand backup and then wait. Monitor the status until it changes from the running state and shows it's completed. Reconfirm this by checking protected resources. Navigate to the EC2 console. Terminate the instance that we chose earlier to backup. Because we are restoring our instance, navigate to the AWS Backup Service, then select Backup Vault. Go to Backup section. Choose Actions, and then select Restore. Note that we have options to change some of our previous settings, such as the security group, VPC, IAM role, and so on, while we restore. Navigate to Jobs on the AWS Backup Console to see the status of the restored instance. The status shows that it's completed. Go to your instance on the EC2 console and then verify that the instance was returned to active. Then validate your settings by checking the security group, VPC ID, subnet, storage, and status. We were able to restore our instance successfully. In the AWS Backup Console, choose Backup Vault. Choose the Backup Vault where you stored the backup. Select a recovery point. Choose the Actions drop-down list. Then choose Delete. Go to the Backup Vault. Select the vault you created, then type the name of the vault and delete. And now you know how to create and set up AWS backup configurations on different work streams for AWS managed services with an accelerator account. Thanks for watching 
and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS. Thank you.